Right here in downtown Chatfield, there's some cool looking buildings and this is one of them. Let's go inside, learn more about this business. Welcome to the market update. I've been uh, following this account on Instagram for a little bit and it's been inspiring and it's been cool to watch and it's got all the right vibes to make me want to find out more. So here I am, I honestly know nothing. Learn, let's learn about your business. What is the name of it and who am I here with? Uh, my name's Melissa Klima and we're at my shop Adorn in Chatfield. So what is Adorn? Adorn is, well, it's a lot of things. It's a mix of um, refinished furniture, a lot of handmade. So I refinish all of the antique and vintage furniture I have. Um, I make the pillows, I make the candles, the jewelry, and then I add in new home decor with everything. Um, and along with that, I offer design services and custom painting. Wow. So that's, you just have a, a good eye. It's like an artistic eye in some way. I think so. Yeah. I, I hope so, yeah. I think it comes across on your Instagram account. So let's let's rewind the clock as far as where did this idea start and how long have you been open? I'm approaching nine years. It'll be nine years this fall. Um, and the idea was a very sporadic decision. I lived in Minneapolis for about 15 years and I did interior design work up there. And the market crashed and I lost my job. So I moved back to this area, this is where I'm from, um, and I tried to start a design company and the market just wasn't ready for it at that time. And I started painting furniture out of my garage and um, decided that I was gonna open a store. So I started looking for buildings and um, found this place. And this building just has a lot of great history, I can tell, with it's the brick. So tell us a little more about this building and what you've done inside. Um, we rehabbed, my husband and I rehabbed the entire, the entire building. Um, it was built in 1870 and it's the perfect backdrop that I wanted for my shop. I love, I love history, I love old, old buildings and just the character that they have. And so this was a hardware store for years and years in Chatfield and um, it had layers and layers of stuff on the floor, on the walls, on the ceiling. So we ripped everything down to the um, bare brick and sanded the floors. And it's pretty, you know, it just kind of all came together. And even on the outside, I like your choices of color. So talk a little bit about what you did with the facade. It's changed about three or four times since I've opened. Um, when I first opened, it was a very vintagey feel outside. Um, and I actually just changed my um, colors and put up my shiplap outside a couple of years ago to give it a more modern sort of feel, I guess. Um, just because everything in the shop has evolved and changed in the last nine years, so it needed, it needed an update. Let's talk through holiday season's coming. What are some of the hot items that people are always looking for that they find in your store? During holiday, I really like to make it special, so I have a lot of um, handmade in here, and I think those are really special, one-of-a-kind gifts that people are looking for. And what's an example of some of those? I do a lot of different ornaments, and I have a lot of um, local artists that create ornaments and macrame and all sorts of different things for every day at the shop, but holidays special, and so we do, we do more then. Great. Well, I could ask questions for hours, but I won't. I think people just need to follow you on Instagram and come in here and visit the store. How can they find out more about your store, about some of your services? Where can they go online? Online, um, on Instagram, I'm at Shop Adorn. Um, and on Facebook, the same. And I also have a website, um, shopadorn.com. Awesome. Thanks so much for joining the Market Update.